In a city steeped in history, there's one place with a fresh take on tomorrow. Welcome to the seaport. With the Harbor Islands a short ferry ride from the Port of Boston, locals ship off from the seaport to camp, fish, or just get away from it all. Back on shore, modern styles and open spaces are on display at Fan Pier, where Louis of Boston, neighboring Sam's Restaurant, and Salon Mario Russo have all set up shop. Take the Silver Line to the exciting exhibits and city views at the Institute of Contemporary Art. Opened in 2006 to artists such as Shepard Ferry and Cindy Sherman, it's a centerpiece of Seaport's cutting-edge attitude. With all the new eateries popping up in Seaport, why not try one without a name? No Name Restaurant opened its doors on Fish Pier in 1917, and it's been owned and operated by Jimmy Contos and family ever since. Next, hop over to the Harpoon Brewery, where fine craft beers are made. Famous for their India Pale Ale, the friendly crew at Harpoon hosts tastings twice a day. In nearby Fort Point, longtime residents like the Children's Museum and the James Hook Lobster House welcome a growing number of newcomers. You'll find Jody Adams Trade Restaurant here. And just up the street, Barbara Lynch has opened the upscale Mentone and the casual Italian lunch counter Sportello. At Tucked Away Flower Bakery, owner Joanne Chang serves up specialty sandwiches and decadent desserts. There's no denying that Boston is reborn by the water. See for yourself in the seaport.